Electric vehicles are the future. We all know that by now. With people getting aware of their carbon footprint, they are choosing EVs to be a part of the ongoing Going Green movement. So the EV industry is getting quite the flow of customers lately. With all those new customers, the EV industry is bound to get some innovative touch, and the first major advancement seems to be in the battery department. The increased use of lithium-ion batteries in everything, from portable electronics to grid-scale energy storage, has also spurred battery research. For quite some time, the solid-state battery is being touted as the next holy grail of the EV industry. But what stage of development is it on right now, and how far are we from seeing it in mass production? We will be talking all about that in this video. What is solid state replacing? Lithium-ion batteries have had a massive impact on the world, unlocking the potential in portable electronics, and more recently, electric vehicles and grid-scale energy storage. Putting it in simple words, Lithium-ion batteries have revolutionized the electric world by providing the solution of proficient energy storage. Electric vehicles have been powered by lithium-ion batteries for years now, but in this world, nothing lasts in the first position forever. So as the demand keeps growing, lithium-ion just keeps coming up a bit short. Lithium-ion batteries are constructed with a liquid electrolyte inside, which makes them heavy and susceptible to instability at high temperatures. These high temperatures are linked to some safety concerns. Most EVs employing lithium-ion batteries have a range of 300 miles or less, and they take a bit longer to recharge. And in this world, where people are always in a hurry, it makes the technology a bit old school. Solid-state batteries with some solid stats. Solid-state batteries have captured manufacturers' attention with the promise of improving the safety, energy density, and range of electric vehicles. Instead of the flammable liquid electrolytes used in conventional lithium-ion batteries, battery cell manufacturers install solid-state batteries with electrolytes in a solid form, making them much more stable than the liquid ones. Without the need for a liquid electrolyte, the batteries can be much denser and more compact. Solid-state batteries can reach an 80% charge within 15 minutes and incur less strain after multiple charging cycles. In the case of range, the solid-state researchers are claiming some high numbers. Some are even saying 600-plus mile range capacity on one charge. On top of that, according to research, the production cost of manufacturing solid-state batteries could be 40% of that of current lithium-ion batteries when they reach full-scale production. This battery technology could increase the lifetime of electric vehicles to that of gasoline cars by 10 to 15 years without the need to replace the battery. Where is solid-state technology now? If this new battery technology is that big of a deal, why isn't it in every car on the street? That's the question that can pop up in many of our minds. Just like other emerging technologies, solid-state batteries are expensive, which is due partly to development costs, but it's also heavily related to the fact that they're hard to manufacture on a large scale right now. This technology is surely showing some great promise as the EV battery of the future, with all those cool stats. And for that, automakers and battery manufacturers are putting in hard work to make solid-state batteries mainstream. Ongoing Development There are many promising projects on solid-state batteries going on around the world. Some of them are Solid Power Inc. This company produces solid-state batteries for electric vehicles and has advanced silicon, all solid-state batteries to production lines in Colorado as part of a wider effort to supply new lines of electric vehicles. Ford initially invested in the Colorado-based startup in 2019. Rather than overhaul infrastructure already in place, Solid Power proposes to adapt conventional lithium-ion battery manufacturing lines and equipment to produce solid-state batteries. Solid Power will begin production of the automotive batteries in early 2022, aiming to commercialize it in 2026. 
They'll be used for the testing and development of upcoming Ford and BMW vehicles starting then too. Samsung Samsung has developed a solid-state battery prototype in 2020. This battery would give an EV a range of about 500 miles and have a life cycle of more than 1,000 recharges, according to the researchers. Samsung announced recently that it would develop large all-solid-state battery cells and prototype all-solid-state battery cells by 2025 and initiate mass production in 2027. QuantumScape California-based QuantumScape started in 2010 to lock down solid-state battery technology. In December 2020, Quantum released a report about its development. According to the report, its solid-state cells can charge to 80% of capacity in 15 minutes and retain more than 80% of its capacity after 800 charging cycles. Dimscape's CEO and co-founder, Jagdeep Singh, recently stated that the company hoped to bring its solid-state battery to the market as soon as possible. But as for timing, this isn't supposed to hit initial production until 2024. Investments Well, there are some automotive companies and governments involved in investing in this development process. Japan on top Considering the increasing interest in solid-state batteries, Governments around the globe have been putting some money to make it happen. For example, the Japanese government has been supporting the domestic development of solid-state batteries to remain competitive against China. Japan is organizing a fund of about 2 trillion yen, $19.2 billion, to promote decarbonization technology. Japan currently accounts for 68% of patents related to the solid-state battery. Japan's government is spearheading the commercialization of solid-state batteries. Car makers, including Toyota, Honda Motor, and Nissan Motor, as well as battery manufacturers, chemical companies, and universities are receiving funds and accumulating know-how under the leadership of LabTech. Dyson In 2019, Dyson decided to kill its most anticipated electric vehicle project. But instead of totally abandoning it, the company decided to continue the $3.1 billion investment program into new technology and plans to focus on manufacturing solid-state batteries. Our battery will benefit Dyson in a profound way and take us in exciting new directions, stated company founder James Dyson. Toyota Toyota Motor, the world's biggest car producer in 2020, has long been considered a front-runner to produce a commercially viable solid-state battery. This company stands at the top of the global heap, with over 1,000 patents involving solid-state batteries. It would be more stable and faster to charge than the lithium-ion batteries used today by car makers from Tesla of the US to China's BYD. Toyota plans to announce a prototype of a car powered by a solid-state battery by the end of the year 2021 seeking to launch a vehicle in the early 2020s. Volkswagen Germany's Volkswagen started working with QuantumScape Core in 2012 to develop a perfect solid-state battery and went on to launch a joint venture in 2018. The companies agreed in mid-May to select a location in Germany for a production plant devoted to piloting solid-state batteries. Hyundai the South Korean manufacturing company Hyundai has invested around $100 million in the solid-state battery specialist Solid Energy Systems. This company seeks pilot production of electric vehicles installed with solid-state batteries in 2025. What about mass availability? Development costs and manufacturing difficulties are key disadvantages in producing solid-state batteries for mass-market EVs. But just as lithium-ion batteries became more affordable, the idea is that the solid-state version will be too. The biggest challenge for solid-state batteries is getting their prices down to where they can compete with the incumbent technology. That will take a while. But with all these works going on, the solid-state battery will likely take off after 2025, although small-scale production may happen even earlier. 
Well, the market research saying the solid-state battery industry will be worth $4.3 billion by 2027 can give you an idea of how close we are to this holy grail of technology. That's all for now. I hope you've learned all about the solid-state battery's arrival. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't, and turn on notifications so you're up to date on the channel's updates. See you in the next video!